Hey everybody, it's Amanda. And normally I would do a one shot, but I'm in the middle of something. I figured I'd show it to you. I'm not doing a tutorial, but let me show you what I'm up to and we'll talk about what's been going on. I'm making jam. Look how pretty that is. So this isn't even actually turned on yet. Um, I'm bringing that to a boil for the um, lids and I got my jars all ready. And I'm waiting for this uh, water bath canner to come to a point. It's not quite there yet. But we're making strawberry jam. I have a crazy mess sitting here. And I'm using Sure Gel just because that's what I was able to um, get a good deal on. But I also have the ball pectin as well that I'll probably use for other things in the future. So this is what I'm up to today. Oh, by the way, no sponsor or anything. This is just what I have. So this is what I'm up to today, and I'm very excited about it. Um, I haven't actually done any canning by myself in a lot of years. Normally I do it with friends, but obviously, you know, quarantine. So I'm doing it by myself, and it'll be okay. <laughs> but that's kind of why I'm not doing any kind of tutorial on it, because even though I know what I'm doing, I don't feel comfortable making videos. But, you know, I'll link the shore gel video up at the top, and then you guys can get it from the professional people. Anyway, so, um, so this is what I'm doing right now. I'm going to show you my plants that are sitting in the corner. It's been kind of cool lately. So I have, we don't have anything else out in the garden and it's because it's been so cool. Nothing in the garden is really like shot up or anything. Um, but my baby plants are looking good. I'm going to show it to you. Here they are. And my tomatoes are looking good, except you can see the ones that have the heads bit off. Lady decided she needed a little snack, but all the true leaves are coming out and, um, I had cut out the extra bend down here the extra sprouts but it looks like there's a few more that are popping up that I'm gonna need to um, trim out as well but anyway so over here we have my um, herbs and things so this is basil basil's looking good and this is dill looking okay this is lemon balm oops lemon balm not clear there we go lemon balm and you can see there's one little tiny lemon balm in there so hopefully that'll pop up and then ladies hair is everywhere this right here is marjoram and we've got some of that this one is still empty and I'm kind of sad because it's oregano but oregano is like a hot oh, hold on maybe there is a little oregano in there I couldn't see it except on the camera look at that can you guys see that right there Oh, I was thinking it was a hot weather plant, so maybe I wouldn't come up just yet, but look at that. Parsley, looking good. Thyme, looking good. This is another one that hasn't come up, tarragon. And I'm going to look at it with the camera and see if I see any sprouty things looking, but I don't really see any of that. And then rosemary. I am disappointed about the rosemary. There's cat hair in there. But anyway, so peppers. These four right here, one, two, three, four, are peppers. And you can see my peppers are just starting to come up. It's like I said, it got really cool outside, but um, we're keeping it semi warm in here. So they're doing okay. And this one was actually full of sprouts, but again, the lady ate them. So, <laughs> so they're less. And this was um, broccoli and kale, I think. And then I got to look at my chart. I have a chart for these. And then these, again, are my tomatoes looking beautiful, if I do say so myself, except for, of course, like I said, Lady ate them. There's really only one. If you see this one little row right in here, that's the only one that didn't pop up. And that was some really old seed that I had. The rest of them popped up, but they got eaten or, you know, knocked down or something for one other reason. So this lady right here, look at her. Look at the lady. She's so naughty. You can see the garden out in the, my dirty window. Anyway, and then over here is my peppermint, which I had despaired of ever coming up. And my peppermint's looking good. And then I had these garlic that were sprouting, and I was like, I might throw them in the garden. So I might do that in a few days. So anyway, plants. My garden's good. I hear something boiling. Let's go check. No, we're starting to have some boiling action. 
I'm gonna give it just a few more minutes but Rick is out today if you didn't catch our live event we had some big changes in our house I'm gonna turn this down because I have the water boiling for the lids we have some big changes in our house and uh, number one Ricky is engaged to Alyssa which is very exciting and number two Rick got a new job and he is in law enforcement so right now he is being sworn in by the sheriff for his job in law enforcement so yay so when he comes in I'll probably show you him because he's all dressed up and nice and you need to see that in your life so um so that's really exciting in the meantime I'm making jam so I'll show you as we get more progress on the jam I still have a lot of whole strawberries I don't know if you can see this I don't know if that's enough for a second batch um but we have something else we're doing today something else major that I'll probably show you. And if we have to, I'll go out and um, I might see how much strawberries I have. And if I need any more to finish this batch, we might run and grab that just to make sure we finish because I don't want anything to go to waste. Um, but yeah, looking good. Okay, so I just got, I'm gonna show you right here, ignore my mess, all of the jam into the jars and they're in the canner. It was at a boil, but I had to, it, it's got the lid on, I gotta bring it back to a boil and then hopefully they'll be ready soon and then I can pull them out. But I've been like, you know, I waited for this pot to cool down a little bit and I was like licking the spoon. So good. Make homemade jam. So here's the handsome man. Look at him. Look at him all formal. Looking all good. The jam is still in the canner processing and he walked in. So how was the swearing in? Do you feel like official? Yes. 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 All right. Well, I'm going to feed this man. But Hello. you did good. He's clearly quite hungry if he's quiet. So I haven't I haven't eaten yet. So I'm going to finish the strawberry. Are you excited about my jam? Yeah, I, I actually my mind is kind of spacey. Yeah, so, you're thinking about too so many things. I came in and I thought, what, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I forgot. all right, strawberry jam. Making my jam. We'll be back. All right. I don't know if you can see the from a good angle. Let me come over here. There's my jam looking all good. I've already heard some of it pop. I gotta get the water off to the top there. But they are sitting there beautifully ready to go. And they gotta sit there overnight before I mess with them. So, yay! So it's Mother's Day. It's another day. But I wanted to show you our other good news because we actually had something else that we had happen recently. And that's that we got a new vehicle. So I'm going to show you our new van from the porch, which I love and is super roomy so we can go places with the whole family and stuff and nobody has to be squished. So let me show you the van. There she is. It's our baby looking so good. So that's our van. I mean, she's not new, new. She's new to us, but um, she's beautiful. We're very glad to have her. Of course, paid cash, of course. So she's paid for and completely ours. So that is our new van. So that is just a little update. My porch is crazy. Just, just, just don't even look at my porch right now. <laughs> but um, we hope to have um, everything out in the garden this week. Uh, if everything goes as the weather says, because um, we're way past our uh, last frost date. If everything goes as it's supposed to, no later than Thursday. We should have everything out in the garden and just fully going outside. All of the summer plants and everything going out there. So the raised beds are sitting there waiting. It's been very, very cold. We've had really late frosts, like super late, um, which I know a lot of people around the country are experiencing that too. So I'm looking forward to spending the day outside Thursday and just really focusing on the garden. So that is our quick update. You guys saw my jam which is delicious. I hope you check out that sure gel video and give it a try. And uh, you saw the little plants that I have. 
you saw Rick so happy with his new job and now you've seen our van. So hopefully we'll be getting videos here soon. The states are starting to open up and I'm considering sharing a grocery haul soon. <laughs> no promises. I'm trying to stay out of that until a lot of the fervor dies down. I said I, said I wouldn't do it until everything opened back up. It's starting to open back up. So we'll see how it goes and then I'll think about sharing another grocery haul as soon as it's all is peaceful. So anyway, I've, I have cats. The cats just stay around my feet and they play with my skirt. <laughs> but anyway, so everything is really good. I hope you guys are doing well and uh, thank you for continuing to stay with us and hang out with us and hopefully we'll bring you some new stuff soon. So anyway, we'll see you guys next time. Bye!